guys, it is Monday morning and I woke up and realized today that my daughter's second birthday party is in six days. It's really bright over there. Um, and I don't have like everything done that I need to get done. I don't even know who's really coming. We're doing a small, I'm sorry, my dogs are eating and they're really loud, but um, I'm doing a small birthday party this year just because of the quarantine and corona and all that stuff. So it's just gonna be my family, but I don't know who exactly is coming. I'm kind of letting them decide on their own. So I need to find out who's actually coming. I need to get the cake. I need to figure out what food to get or make and I need to finish up the decorations and stuff. So I'm going to get dressed, get the kids dressed, and we're gonna go probably to Target and kind of look around for some decoration stuff. I do have um, like the basics. I have cups, plates, napkins, silverware, that kind of thing. Actually, I'll go ahead and show you what I got. All right, so this is what we've gotten so far. We're going with sort of a pink floral type vibe for this party. So I've got the plates. I've got some napkins that are two different kinds. Bigger plates, a tablecloth for the outdoor table, cups, um, silverware, more napkins, and yeah, that's all that I've gotten so far. And I do want to show you her party dress because I love it. I don't know how well you guys can see it, but there's a giant bow on the front and it's like tulle. The back. I think it's so precious. She's gonna look so cute in it. And then I also ordered her these little flower crowns. Don't know which one she's gonna wear yet. We'll see how well the pink goes with it. If not, she'll just wear the white. And then these are the shoes that she's gonna wear. It's got little heels on them. They're super cute. She loves those. Do you wanna say good morning? Say good morning. Good morning, Noel. Good morning, Noel. Okay, love, do you want to say good morning? Hi! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, um, okay. Well, hello! All right, so I'm going to finish getting ready and getting them ready, and then we will go to Target and try to see what we can find. All right, we are back home now. We ended up going to Publix first to look at their cakes and I looked through their book that they had. And honestly, I just had too many questions that I didn't feel like asking anyone. So I'm gonna try to go online a little bit later and see if I can just order one online and see if I can figure things out on my own. If not, I will have to go back in and ask somebody. I think my biggest issue was that I just wanted to pull from like other cakes and just kind of make a whole custom thing and I don't know if they can do that for me so we'll see. And then we went to Target and I tried to look for some like flowers which I did find. I found some flowers. I really don't know what I'm going to do with them yet but hopefully I can figure something out that's like cute for the party. And I'm also going to order a number two balloon. A big one and it comes with some like confetti balloons pink ones pink and white ones and those will be really cute those should be here Wednesday and then I'm gonna order her a happy birthday banner I haven't found one yet that I like but I have to find one that will get here in time for the party this last minute stuff is crazy but yeah I'll keep you guys updated on how all of that goes about to feed little man his yogurt I've started making all of his food now so this is just like a big tub of the plain whole milk yogurt and I blended up some strawberries and added those in oh we got a new table by the way it's actually not new it's um, passed down from my husband's grandma which is really awesome and I actually think it looks really cute over there it's like the brand is Ethan Allen so it's really really nice solid wood and yeah, I just love it. I think it looks really good there. I'm walking down the street on clouds instead of the concrete. I'm dancing through. Everything's about to come my way. Nothing can ruin my day. No matter what anyone does or say, I smile at fools. No, I don't care because I am on my way up. And I won't stop. I won't slow down. Steady on my feet, I'm going to ride. No, I won't 
stop, it is my time mm -hmm. Cause I know what it's like to be broke I know what it's like when nothing goes your way So I'm gonna let myself enjoy The fruit from this lucky day Yeah, I am on my way I won't slow down Yeah, I am on my way up I won't slow down I'm strolling down the street With all of my favorite songs on repeat I'm dancing through Everything's about to come my way And I don't care if you spill coffee on me Or if the sky is gray or blue No, I don't care cause I am I'm really glad we got home when we did because it is like storming outside. It's really windy and a lot of rain, so I'm glad we got home before all of that happened. Hey guys, it's actually the next day. I'm wearing the same shirt that you saw in the last clip because I fell asleep in it. Don't act like you guys have never done that before. <laughs> That's like typical mom life dishwasher going got the dishes done a candle this one is called secluded dunes we're trying to get into the beach spirit which we're not even sure if we're gonna be going on vacation at least not like when it was scheduled because we're supposed to leave next weekend not this weekend coming up but next weekend and we don't know if the vacation rentals are gonna open up or not hopefully they do so we can go in time because we really need this vacation and I really don't want to have to wait any longer. Caleb is over here eating some puffs. Noelle's down here playing with her shopping cart and stuff. She's going to get that stuff everywhere. You want to see yourself? Here, let me sit down. Say hi. Oh, okay. Say hi. Good morning. Hi. Good morning. <laughs> My dad will be here soon. If you don't know this, he comes over twice a week to help me out with the kids for a couple hours. So that is super helpful. Yeah, we're still filming. <laughs> You got your backpack? Oh, jeez. Well, that was cute. Okay, I've started a new upload schedule, and I did mention that in the video that's not gonna go up, but I'm gonna try to be doing Tuesdays and Fridays now instead of just Fridays, because Fridays is just too big of a stretch between videos for me. So, we're gonna try Tuesdays and Fridays. Obviously not this Tuesday, so you won't know the difference because I wasn't posting on Tuesdays anyway. But next Tuesday, fingers crossed. If I can get my fingers on camera. Fingers crossed. We will have a video up on Tuesday. So it's a lot later now. I didn't film any more of our morning before nap time because it just got really bad. And I debated not talking about it, but then I was like, well, I'm always thinking that I don't want to just sugarcoat things and make you guys think that my life is like great and fantastic and perfect and all of the things. So, uh, <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> so 
so yeah we just had a really rough morning for multiple reasons first one obvious reason i have a toddler and a baby so they both decided that they wanted to be super super cranky and noelle was acting out and not listening to me and my dad was over so it was just not that it was embarrassing but i just i didn't want i should have reacted differently to how she was acting and i should have just handled it better you coming to say hello i'm talking about you <laughs> But yeah, she was being a toddler, you know, just... Oh, Caleb just spit up all over the rug, so I'm gonna have to clean that up real fast. Hang on. Can you say goodness gracious? Goodness gracious. Yeah, and the next thing, I'm trying to be careful about what I'm saying because you just have to when it comes to this. But I'm just a little, not a little, I'm a lot frustrated with how certain things are going right now. And I just wasn't able to stay positive. And everything was irritating me. So on top of the kids acting out, it was just a huge mess this morning. I'm, I could have reacted better to everything but I just didn't and you know sometimes you just have those days luckily they did take a long nap like a three hour nap which almost never happens anymore so I was very thankful for that it gave me a time to relax and just fix my mood make me a little bit more positive so hopefully the rest of our day goes a little bit better so far so good they woke up in a great mood <laughs> which is good for everyone. But yeah, I'm just trying to stay positive. I don't wanna go into too much detail about what I'm personally dealing with, but um, it's just been hard sometimes. Some days are harder than others. So if any of you guys who are watching this video are struggling during this time about certain things that maybe were supposed to happen and that can't happen, or whatever the case, um, I feel you, I'm right there with you. And just trying to be positive, trust God, trust his plan. Because ultimately this is completely out of my hands. So there's no use worrying about it because it's just gonna make me more anxious, more upset, more angry. Just trying to fix myself when it comes to that. But I totally understand the struggle if you guys are going through it too. But with all that being said, I am gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. It wasn't super interesting this week, but we've just had a lot going on and also nothing going on, if that makes any sense at all. So if you liked it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new here. And I will see you guys next week with my new video. Bye.